here's the cockpit we've got the um, wheel stand here the ship's wheel is in storage at present but it does come with the boat plenty of storage in here the storage you got the uh, under here you've got the place for the uh, gas all the gel coat is there's no cracks in the gel coat up here looks like it can just do with a polish uh, there's some cracks around this one here doesn't look like it's structural though, it feels solid still there's no movement there that's good that feels good, cleats are good, no corrosion I might take a look on inside now steps down into the into the boat We've got where the this is where the oven goes. He's got it in storage. That goes with the boat, and the oven and the stove top. Got the line here. We've got the power power for the boat is there. All the wiring has been checked. The wiring is uh, checked out good. This inner has got cracks in it there, but that can be replaced. Most of the windows, the porthole windows, do not leak. Got a two-way radio there, rather modern one, so that's not bad. There's storage underneath the air conditioner there. So I can't, I'm not about to go in there. And we've got, uh, this is the main cabin room. We've got uh, the bed. This is the tabletop which will slide back down and can make it into a bed. I'm actually standing without hunching over in here and my head is about an inch off the roof. So that's not too bad at all. Little window that's clear, no hazing, no cracks. This is the V-berth. It's got a hatch above. The uh, ceiling will need panelling done. Each of these windows have no crazing or cracks in them, so that's good. In behind this door here is the head. And that works perfectly fine. There's sort of a shower head there. But I can't see any... Wait a minute, yes, there is a drain in the floor, so yeah, you can shower in here too. So there's that. And we can see the ceiling there it needs to be relined again. That's probably the main amount of work that you'd be doing in here. There will need to be some plywood repair done in this corner here. It's had a little bit of water ingress in the corner there. I think on the other side as well. Let's have a look. Feel free to slide that stuff out of the way. Alright, that's okay. Turn. The original paneling is in that one. That side there looks very nice. You can probably copy that and put it back in over the other side, which is showing the hole. But, again, Good condition. It's a nice solid boat, very honest. Needs a little bit of work, but for this, that's the water from the air conditioning is in the bilge, so he's going to pump that out. And that's just some paneling that needs to be boomed down. And that, I think, is about it for in here. Now, just some storage space in there. This is the engine here. Now the engine itself, okay, I was kind of hoping I could get a nut on the front and see if it would crank over, but it's not going to. He's got a spare engine to go with this, to replace it with, that is a good runner. 
So if worst comes to worst, you pull this one out, mm -hmm. the other one goes in. It depends on what he does in the next few weeks. Alrighty, that's the end of the tour, I think. I'm going to turn it off there.